Hey guys, this is you say D Wheeler here, and today I got another box opening for you. It is Trial Deck 4 from Vanguard G, Divine Marine Spirits, and it's the Aqua Force Clan used by Jamie Alcaraz from the Vanguard G series. Or, if you want to say it the Spanish way, Jaime Alcaraz. Whichever way you want. That's what they said in Japanese, they use the Spanish way. English way, they just use the English way. Either way, it's the same thing. Alrighty, well... Let's get opening. I mean, today was the release of this trial deck and the Dimension Police trial deck. I am not using Dimension Police, therefore I did not get any. Well, I got some for my brother, but he's already opening those himself, so yeah. So let's get this thing open. I probably should have cut this first, but whatever. I'm opening them now. Yeah, let's just... I'm not really saving the boxes, so yeah. There we go. Alright. Tape's stuck to my finger. Alright, for those of you uh, who probably seen my uh, unboxing of the Japanese special set, though, it's pretty much the same thing, only it's just a trial deck, but... This is in English, though. So here it is. Let's find that little perforated, the perforated edge still thing. There we go. All right. Did that work? All right. <laughs> now they're making this easier to open now, because before it was like a death trap. Alrighty, so we have hmm. Let's get a little more lighting in here. Let me see if I can just kind of move this. move myself. All right, we got the main unit, the one who surpasses the storm, Thavas, which we all thought it was gonna be Savas, but I guess it's translated to Thavas. Okay. For those of you who know, here's his skill. Pause and read at your leisure. You get one hollow and one non hollow. I bought four of the decks though, but I'm only going to do one unboxing because, well, there's no sign cards in here. Alright. And here are your G units Marine General of the Heavenly Scales, Tidal Boar Dragon. That's your generic one. Just pause and read at your leisure. You get one hollow and one non hollow. So, there we go. Alrighty, so for the rest of the deck, you get Titan of the Beam Fist. You just focus. Alright. Yeah. Titan of the Beam Fist. You get two Battery Boom Dragons. You're gonna get four. Of the vanillas, the new vanillas, Kelpie, Ryder, Dennis. Personally, I like Tear Knight Lazarus better, and I also like the Blue Storm one, the Blue Storm Tempest Assault. Because they're cool. I don't know, they look cooler to me. You got Battle Siren Road. This is the 12k attacker generation break unit. And one of my favorite cards in the set Magnum Assault. Okay, well. For those of you who probably are unaware, though, there's a misprint here, the Generation Break. Uh, this is, uh, you may pay the cost. See, they forgot to add in the Counter Blast cost, because this guy, when you want to use his Generation Break skill, it has you have to pay the Counter Blast cost. And they kind of forgot to do that, so... I don't know, so for those of you, for those of you wondering, though, yeah, he does require the Counter Blast, and yeah. And I... I don't know. Probably when they re-release it, though, I'm probably going to just buy the this card singly just so I can get the corrected version, though. Because he does need the Counter Blast cost if you don't... if Because without the Counter Blast cost, he'd be kind of broken, though. But it, it's intended, though, that he's going to Counter Blast. So you get one Hollow and one Non-Hollow. I got four of them because I wanted two play sets of it because I'm going to put one in my Blue Storm deck and one in my uh, deck for this guy. All right. 
Now you have two Hydro Hammer Sailor, a special intercept. Alright, now we're into grade ones. We get Kelpie Rider Polo, 8K Vanilla. I like the Tier Knight, uh, the, the 8K Tier Knight. Man, it's been so long since I used him, I forgot his name now. Uh, wh whatever. <laughs> In any case, though, moving along. I don't want to keep this video long. Railgun Assault, this is the 10k attacker for... Uh, oh yeah, Tier Knight Theo. There we go. Now I remember. But in any case, uh, Railgun Assault, this is the 10k Generation Break attacker. And here is the 10k booster for Generation Break. This is Gunner Diver Draco Kid. And we have... Our Perfect Guard. Battle Siren Phydra. I really liked her design. Really nice. You get three Mind Star Troopers. This is when he gets attacked, he gains 5,000, so that's pretty cool. And then for the starter, we have uh, Officer Cadet Andre. Generation Break 1, put this unit to the soul. Choose one of your regards until the end of the turn it gets. Once per turn. At the end of the battle, it's unit attack. Stand this unit, and this unit gains plus 2,000 until the end of the turn. Eh, not bad. I don't know. I may consider using them, or either that, or I'll probably use Officer Cadet Eric, the Grade 3 Searcher. Alright, so you get four critical triggers. There's Bubble Bazooka Draco Kid. You get four draw triggers. Rainbow Sniper. You get uh, two regular stand triggers, keen eyed seahorse soldier, and you get four heal triggers. I really like this heal trigger. Battle Siren Carolina. And you get two of the stand triggers with the effects. The, this one, one of them hollow, one non hollow. Officer Cadet Elect Boys. At, uh, at the end of the battle, did this unit attack? Choose one of your other rear guards. You may. Exchange position with this unit, and if you do, return this unit to your deck and shuffle your deck. Alright. Well. Alright, that'll be it for this uh, unboxing, though. I know uh, tomorrow is... Uh, for those who live in California, tomorrow is the uh, Spring Fest, though. We're the team that leagues for Vanguard. I already have my team set. We are ready, and tomorrow we're... Hope to see some of you there, alright? Alrighty, this is Yusei D. Wheeler, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care!